love beautiful family just dropping in for a little tune in about a couple of retreats that are up and coming and just on our way teleporting here with universal love aloha beautiful fam teleporting to do ceremony with our beloved Jose Munoz tonight, the Mayan day keeper. And um, we're doing a ceremony to bring the sweat lodge back to East LA. We were with our beloved retreats that we sent information out for today. And these two retreats will be one day per week for the next three weeks, aligning us with very significant energetic windows. So we and Universal Love did a ceremony with Jose for the winter solstice. We did fire ceremony and we were also together for New Year's Eve at the Rama Institute in Santa Monica, which is a Kundalini Institute of Inner Technology. And so we have inner technology and this is a really powerful miracle in time to be learning how to activate our inner technologies. One of the things that Jose shared at the New Year's Eve celebration was the cycles that we are heading into cycles of super abundance for those who understand how the cycles work who know how to align ourselves with the cycles and who understand how to take inspired action and to know what inspired action is to harvest the fruits of the cosmic energies that naturally flow through our bodies. So the way that I describe the long count of the Mayan calendar is that the long count of the Mayan calendar relates to how energies run through our physical human bodies in relationship to nature. We humans are a part of the natural world and in urban settings we have possibly become quite removed from that connection and so the Mayan calendar is very different than the Gregorian calendar. And the Mayan calendar reminds us of how nature flows through our physical form and different energies are activated in different days in the Mayan calendar. And so that calendar is all about knowing which days are powerful for meditation and which days are powerful for taking action and which days are powerful for fasting and so on because it just relates to how nature runs through the anatomy of our physical form. So what Jose has been sharing is that we are moving into this rapid acceleration of manifestation and abundance. And so the two retreats that I'm guided to be sharing in the next few weeks are retreats to assist those who are inspired to come into alignment with. And so we all have our specialties and these transmissions are to support people who have been focused on their specialties and these transmissions come from the specialty of knowing how to use precise articulation to align us with cosmic energies. So there's two transmissions I'm offering. One of the transmissions is called um, igniting our superpowers lit from within and that transmission is precise articulation to wire our neural networks to see that we are already embodied in our divinity and so people might find that their world kind of doesn't look like they are the creator of it or doesn't look like they are in control of their world or doesn't look like the world has changed very much but the world has changed a lot and so the lit from within transmission is precise articulation these transmissions ignite inner technology because the transmissions that I share are technology and so it ignites that technology inside of us to align with our divinity, to see that we are already fully here. 
and to find the articulation that gives the cognitive awareness for the brain to accept the gnosis that we are the powerful creators of our creation. That's what that transmission is offering, is that precise articulation to turn off lower circuitry in the mental processor and to align us with the pure awareness that we are. So people will experience vast empowerment as creators if one is inspired to come into those transmissions meditations. So those will be three days, um, one day a week, recordings are available, and those transmissions, I believe, are being offered on, I don't know, all the information is in the links and description box, I can't remember which way I did it. The other transmission is called The Power of Yin. And so the guidance is really coming in now to assist us as our egoic structures continue to dismantle, as the egoic structures of our personalities, of our relationships, of our world and our creations continue to dismantle. How do we function inside of such a vastly metamorphosizing world? So the power of yin is a transmission that provides precise articulation to align us with the sensations of the subtle energies of yin. These bodies are technology. Everything about us is technology. So the transmission assists us to find the energy of yin because yin has been a vastly overlooked energetic in a very young world that we have come from and the ego is very young in how it functions the ego is really just a mechanistic structure and we are moving out of that operating system which is a mental processor and we're coming into the pure awareness just like many of the traditional indigenous peoples who are still very connected with the earth and nature have never left their connection with the yin energies the energies of the feminine the energies of the mother the energies of nature and the word yin is technology in itself so if you're inspired to come into the yin transmissions, those transmissions provide precise articulation for us to find, to know how to draw energy back in from the ego, from the ego creations, and access the field of yin. The field of yin is the field of creation itself. That's where everything is immaculately conceived from. And as we connect into the yin energies within, we begin to unlock our true supernatural superpowers. So this transmission is like the introduction to awareness, to connect with the field itself, the field of yin. And in that connection, in that awareness, we realize we don't have to work hard at anything. Working hard is the old way of doing things. And the yin transmissions align us with receivership. Creation is much simpler than we have made it in very complex societies. Creation is mostly about the field of yin. It's an energetic that allows manifestation to come in in the most refined and easeful ways. And so as we learn to yin our energy, our life becomes filled with synchronicities, with miracles, with super abundance, with resources, with prosperity in all aspects of our life. And it restores us to the true spirit in form that we are. So that's just a little introduction for today. And I was guided to do this because in the Mayan calendar from Jose, 
we are entering these periods of seed planting days and days of harvest and this is a seed planting day so if you're inspired to consider participating in these retreats even if you're just considering it it is a good day to contemplate or to sign up for the retreats that start next week as i say there will be one retreat on um, wednesdays and one on tuesdays including meditations with them um, and the times again are in the descriptions and the links but it will be spread out over three weeks of this harvest of the seed planting harvest cycle so all three transmissions for each retreat will be inside of the full fruition cycle and everyone who participates in the retreats will take cosmic leaps will benefit will receive the fruits of participating because again the Mayan calendar understands the cycles of energy and how to align with them and we will continue to offer these um, spacious retreats for those who are maybe newbies to coming into these transmissions we have lots of love streams on YouTube, lots of love streams on Facebook if you're curious to learn more about the Unity transmission that I share. And I'll put links for um, YouTube and the Spreaker, the podcast, and so on so you can listen and kind of get a sense. But the true passion of this transmission is our supernatural gifts, our capacities to materialize, dematerialize, think golden apple, produce golden apple in the palm of the hand to really take us back to the refined essence of who we are as spirit in form. So the supernatural is really the exciting place that the transmissions bring us. And these offerings, these retreats are like gateways to find our way out of the mental processor systems that we've been in and back into pure awareness and back into our supernatural capacities as non-physical physical beings or as spirit in form so this is the cutting edge of play and i invite you to come and play with me in this seeding cycle that comes to fruition i think it's on the 25th or 26th so as we say all these transmissions will be inside of the seeding cycle guaranteed to completely rewire the neural networks to dissolve connection to that which is dissolving away and to fully find that place of subtle energy within us where magic happens we love we so much if this love stream is inspiring please share it that's called gifting and if you're interested to find out any more information about the retreats there's links down below so much love.